Hey, a little mini message for us today coming from verse 12 of Genesis chapter 22. Now, remember back in verse 11, the angel of the Lord speaks. This is Christ. Christ is who is speaking here to Abraham. And he tells him, Do not lay a hand on the boy, he said. Do not do anything to him. Now I know that you fear God, because you have not withheld from me your son, your only son. And that is an absolutely incredible statement. Do not lay a hand on the boy. See, God here shows he's not like the, the thoughts that men had about these pagan false idols that they sacrifice people to, they sacrifice their children to. That's not him. God is not pleased by this. And so he tells him, do not lay a hand on the boy. See, it was never God's intention to follow all the way through with this. As we talked about yesterday, if you watch yesterday's, go back and watch. I think, it, I think it's very, very instructive for you that God was revealing His faithfulness and He was also revealing to Abraham, Abraham's own obedience and faithfulness, revealing His own faith to him. So here He stops him in this. He doesn't let him follow through. See, Abraham here displayed his heart towards God in that he was willing to give up his only son. But when we stop and we, we fast forward and we're remembering the symbolism that's taking place here in this passage of what would happen with the Father and the Son as far as God the Father and God the Son. He asked Abraham to do this and then stopped. He supplied. He provided, as we'll see in a day or two. But the Father, God the Father, really did follow through. He really did sacrifice His Son. He really did give Jesus Christ. So, what God wanted to use to show His faithfulness and didn't actually make Abraham follow through with, He was willing to follow through with. See, God asked Abraham for the ultimate demonstration of commitment, the ultimate, de ultimate demonstration of love. And God actually really 100% followed through on that demonstration. What a beautiful example to us. You guys have a blessed day. We'll see you again soon.